freaking fry yay because it's friday i hope you guys are having a fantastic friday and it is beautiful over in your neck of the woods we've already seen some people tuning in and saying that it's a little cold over in colorado so hello to all my friends that are here as you guys tune in share with us where you're visiting from let us know what you've got going on on this beautiful Friday. Rachel, it's almost 80 degrees here. It is here. 78, sunny, and gorgeous right now. Beautiful. I feel like we should be sunbathing oh, it's um, and by the pool. My pale legs were out today, too. I'm wearing shorts, and I'm owning it. I'm owning it. Yes, yeah. I love it. Well, guys, today we are quite a while into our self-quarantine, and we thought, why, what better way to kick off the uh, mid quarantine spark for the weekend then make some awesome social distancing shirts <laughs> they're so cute these are adorable we've been seeing them all over the facebook groups and we we're like we have to make some just so we could laugh um this i just realized this is a large um so i think i'm going to put the i was social distancing before it was cool and then i'm gonna wear it but the joke is i'm an extrovert so <laughs> I wasn't, I haven't been social distancing at all. Um, but yay, we are so, so excited to have you guys here. Um, we're gonna make some really great shirts. We're using some Makers Gonna Learn Cut Balls. We're gonna use some fonts. Today, we still have our flash sale going. If you guys do know nothing about it, um, it is the coupon code FLASH30. You can take advantage of a year membership to Makers Gonna Learn today. Get access to over 2,000 amazing fonts. Seriously, such an amazing value. Our year members also get over 250 fonts. They get our commercial license to make money with their machine and they get three bonus e-courses, which is the value of what you'll pay for the membership if you had to buy just the courses separately. In addition to all the amazing resources and guides that we have in our membership. So, so excited for that. Yesterday, Becca and Rachel talked a lot about our summer summit as we just wrapped on our spring summit. Guys, you need that ticket for that summer summit if you have not went ahead and registered. And the best part is you can complete your passport and using the flash 30 coupon code right down below. It is the summit, su summit passport link. And people said, Tanner, I don't need a spring ticket anymore. I already, you know, had it. Scroll to the bottom of the page and it'll say, summer and fall at it and you'll be good to go so we're so excited for you guys to have um the option to use that coupon code and get it will end today uh, we had so many people want to take advantage of it this morning that we're like you know what it's friday we've got to treat you guys so go ahead and take advantage of that today so yay i cannot wait to see what everyone is up to who has already made some social distancing shirts are you guys ahead of us um, we're featuring some really adorable fonts um, called Click Clack, and we're using Atta Girl. So two fonts that you are going to absolutely love. Were both of these released yesterday? I think um, Atta Girl we had for a while. Okay, so Atta Girl's not got is brand. I don't think Atta Girl's got a lot of love from our team. So we're gonna give it some love today, and we're gonna have a lot of fun. Tanner, it's Miss Violet's one year anniversary Yay! with Makers Gonna Learn. Congratulations, Miss Violet. We are so, so glad that you are um, here as a member. So we are gonna have a lot of fun. Jenny Spears, I think, has used the Atta Girl font. So I'm glad Jenny's been giving it some love. Guys, there are so many different cut falls and fonts that we have to give love and it's gonna take a whole team effort to fully be able to enjoy that so thank you guys so much share all of your projects in the makers gonna learn facebook group i love seeing all the interaction with you guys um becca shared her chocolate gravy recipe um yesterday and Sasset was able to make that so we love it um so we're really excited sally thank you so much for hanging out um with us at the spring summit we loved having you and getting to host all of you guys so seriously what a great day to make some t-shirts we're gonna make two today um and we're gonna kind of break make it break it down to the basics of working with heat transfer vinyl, working with your Cricut machine. We're gonna give the weeding tips, we're gonna give the layer or the tips for positioning your heat transfer vinyl onto any fabrics, specifically shirts. There's some tips we wanna focus on. We wanna make sure that you guys position it roughly three inches from the top of your shirt. Um, and we're gonna be really excited for that. And so, Tanner, yay. we have a question. Okay. Uh, well, number one, I do wanna address, we also, for all of our members, have an amazing printable, uh, along with so many printables. It's normally right here, but we are packing up the office and it will show you how to size decals for t-shirts. So whether you have like a one 
Lindsay all the yeah. way up to like a triple X. We'll have to show it on the when we share the Yeah, screen. it's, it's awesome. really good. And then the question, uh, Tanner, Miss Evie says, I love the paintbrush sign behind you and the must make stuff Ooh. with that gun. Are those files on your site? These are files on the site. So you will be able, once you're a member, download these cut files. Our favorite thing is we have a four makers collection on the cut file category and you'll be able to go over there, find all kinds of great cut files for your craft rooms. So definitely check that out. And again, our membership is $30 off for year members today using the coupon code FLASH30. So if you're new here and you're like, I need a place to get inspiration, education, and motivation, the year membership is our flagship product. Over 75% of our members are yearly um, versus any other tier. So it's the tier to be and you get, we hold nothing back. So it's a really great offer so yay and Tanner this is Miss Ashley's first time catching us <gasps> welcome live. welcome Miss Ashley yay Beverly says my first anniversary as at Makers Gonna Remember woohoo oh my gosh someone says hi Tanner how are y'all I am doing quite well this Friday it has been such lovely weather um Becca taught me how to use my espresso maker today um, that that's was a, a win. That's Rachel, good. how are you? I'm good. I, I think this weather is putting all of us with the quarantine. I forgot and the, the stores and are that, closed. When and I'm you just go outside, focused. you're like this. It's spring now, and I'm happy. You yes. know, it's it's good. I love it. Evie says I bought the year membership. So yay! Congratulations. Welcome, welcome to the family. We're so excited to have you. Miss Kara um, said I think you all are awesome, and so glad I found you for the tips. For my surprise cricket joy, I'm Ooh. getting in a few days. Surprise cricket joy, I'm getting. I, I love, love that, that Kara. You said it's a surprise. Yes, you know that's amazing, my friend. Kind of Cindy, welcome, welcome, welcome. It's your first time. We're so excited to craft with you. We'll be getting started in just a moment. We like to give a few minutes to catch up, especially with all the craziness going on in the world. We have to make sure that we touch on all the happiness and find the joy. Get it? Cricket joy. The joy. <laughs> we we have we have a joy. So, so many dads. We have folks. the joy. <laughs> oh. I love it. But welcome guys. Um so yeah, all you need today for today's project is the shirts that you love. We debated comfort colors or gildan. We pulled out the gildans. These can normally be picked up three for ten at your local Michaels. So that's a little fun tip. Um and then we're gonna use black with white. And then we're using a kind of like a foresty green with black. So you're going to really love how these two go with each other. Again, really awesome. This is a great beginner project. So if you guys are thinking about getting a Cricut, maybe you have a Cricut and you're looking for some fun projects to do, I'm going to break down how to design both of these in Cricut Design Space. We're featuring Makers Gonna Learn Cut Files and Fonts like we do every single day here. Um, and then we're going to give you tips on, we haven't pulled out our 9 by 9 Easy Press, Rachel, in quite some time. It's been a while. Yeah. I thought it was, it's perfect for shirts. And guys, to be honest, we don't do a whole lot of shirts anymore. Right. So we brought her out today. Yeah, it's great. Rachel, what, what's this? one's name that's mini mini like okay. mini mouse mini mouse mm -hmm. i love it well okay let's go ahead and jump into cricut design space to kind of see what we're working with and to see what we need to do for today's project in cricut design space so this is gonna be great well guys here are the designs um and it is so good um what you see right here to the left is the i was social distancing before it was cool and this is using the font click clack um you can download this and it is so easy to set up and design this is gonna be such a great one for you guys um to be able to set up we're gonna set it up together right now because it's that easy so you're gonna click on your text box and you're going to click over on fonts and you'll want to download your um, system fonts to find click clack so you just download it from the site and then you'll be good and now you just want to type out I was and we're gonna do this all in uppercase I was social distancing and then it's getting lower before it was cool and then i'm just gonna put the period and notice we're gonna just move it up and you can see it's right here now rachel how's my spelling of distancing let's make sure it's good becca Okay. Perfect. Becca says it's good. I'm not even going to question it. I love it. I was making sure it was this one. Yeah. Um, so what you guys can notice here is that it just does not look as the 
it does not look like the one above. What the difference here, the only difference you're going to find here is that you are going to see the letter spacing. You, um, you guys may not know that the line space and letter space, um, you can change that and play with it as needed. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to bring that letter space just a hair closer, not too much. Um, we're going to bring it closer a little bit. And then what we're going to do is bring the line space um, right here together as well. So we're going to go right here and go to line space and watch what happens. Let's go bring that together. So this is go, you know, be able to allow you to have a little bit better looking design. Look at this magic. Guys, give me a thumbs up or give me uh, an emoji of your choice if you guys have never worked with line space before. It's uh, it's one of those hacks that not everyone knows, but once you learn it, right? like you're you're just going with it. You use oh, it all the time. It's amazing. Now we do want to talk about our little um, cut file right here. So I'm going to. This is the other one we're going to be designing today. I'm going to bring this down just a little, and then I'm going to kind of grab the other one that we have. And it looks like, oh my gosh, you guys are getting some secrets. I'm getting to see some secret cut falls here. And Tanner, we have a question. Miss yes. Ava says, do you guys like iron-on or infusible ink better? Ooh, okay. So for the shirts we have today, infusible ink would not work on it because they only work for white shirts and very light gray shirts. And you have to have mostly, um, it, don't you have to have mostly poly in it? Yes. So if it's a cotton poly blend, it will work, but not as well. It'll, it'll fade like after you wash it over right. time. I think it has to be a very high um, poly content on that shirt yeah, as well. Yeah, that is true. It's that great for true. certain things though. It's a super interesting material. For sure. I think the cut file that we used is called Rollin' With It. Um, so I'm gonna try to find that. I would just type the word roll. It's Good idea. MGL underscore, go back to Cricut. Okay, to cool. MGL underscore. Home underscore reg, R-E-G. Uh-huh. See if that'll work. Okay, hmm. another underscore. Okay. Uh, R-O-L-L. Hmm. It's right here. So I'll just, we'll just grab it. So if you just want to search roll, you're good. Um, so we're just gonna search roll and then you should be able to see the roll in right here. And this is the awesome, awesome, they see me rolling cut file that we released in our home collection, um, which is so, so good. Um, do you have any free Cricut files or have to be a member? Paulina, um, you will want to be a member to download our cut files, my friend. They cost us quite a bit to have our designers design them. Um, so it would be a great option for you to um, become a member. So I just downloaded that. And then what you're gonna be able to see is um, I'm going to bring the folder right over here. So you guys are gonna be able to open this up. This is what it'll, you know, as soon as you download it, it'll open as a folder. You guys can click on this and you're gonna upload the SVG. So look right here, we're going to click upload image and we're just gonna drag and drop that SVG file right here. You can rename it if needed and then press save. Okay guys, so just press save and then select that right here and click insert image. So we can scroll right down. And Tanner, we have someone saying, can I change the font in the TP? <gasps> yes, so what we're about to do is we're gonna contour out the they see me rolling and we're going to use that new font that we haven't used a lot here called add a girl to add in 2020 survivor so that's gonna be fun that's hilarious really and, and guys i know it's a very serious matter but sometimes it is good to humor just, helps humor helps and we're not trying to do this to lighten the situation we know that it's a very serious thing but sometimes you just have to add some humor we're gonna to make it. it fun yeah you know you guys know how we do so I'm just contouring out the little spaces and the contour button is honestly one of the easiest things to do. So don't be scared of it if you're new and you know wondering how to do it. You just click on the spaces you don't need and then look, you have this beautiful roll of toilet paper, which is vinyl. And I'm sure a lot of us could have used it for a while. 
Oh, Rachel, I pray for your family is doing well. Just keeping your family in my prayers. Rachel, tell Beverly the progress of the Oh, house. yes. I tie back to Miss Beverly. Listen, listen, Miss Beverly. That is so sweet of you. It is, my parents are doing well. The house is making amazing progress. The paint? drywall is up When's and they're the going to paint coming? tomorrow. Amazing. So it is, they hope to be in in just a few weeks. So that's amazing. I love Thank that. you guys so much. Love, love, love that. Um, so, oops, I lost my text box. Let's click on it again. Oh, I lost my text box again. Let's just type out 2020. And then what I want to do is come over here to um, where we have. I would just do the return key again. Oh my gosh. I always forget this hack. You just did it. I know, but I totally oh, forget maybe it, about maybe it. Oh, maybe it makes you think it's odd for numbers to do right? that. I don't yeah. know. So we can just press enter after each number. I don't know why I forget about that every time so then we're going to click this and again look at how these numbers look so much closer together you're just going to want to use line space and bring that together and tanner miss uh i do not want to mess your name up she'll we have she'll, a friend Shalane. just, just my good friend. friend we have a friend yes how did you get to contour <gasps> that's a great question my friend well let me share it with you so you're gonna have this layer, so you can just click on any layer. Now you cannot contour fonts. So what I mean by that is if we click on this, contour goes away. But if we click on an SVG, you can click on it and press contour. So then it comes up, you can select from this row or you can physically click on what you may need. Um, but it's in the contour is after you select the layer, you'll find it at the bottom right hand side of your layers panel. So it just says contour. It's the only button selected at that bottom right. So we actually prefer um, iron-on more than infusible ink due to the fact that it can work on poly uh, cotton blends and everything like that. Um, our awesome, awesome, uh, you know, iron-on works a little bit better and it's not limited to specific colors. So anyway, we're going to bring down the 2020 we were just working on. And we're going to size it up just like this. And then we're going to do the same thing with a new text box. We're going to type out Survivor, S-U-R-V-I-V-O-R. Oops. Let me find my text box and move it over. And Tanner, Miss Carol said, I need to clean my fabric grip mat. Should I use LA's Totally Awesome like the other mats? So we do love the LA's Totally Awesome friend, but what we are about to film is a new video on cleaning mats. And one thing we have been loving, honestly, has been, wait for it, using baby wipes. Mm -hmm. Game changer. We're actually comparing, Tanner's gonna be comparing three different ways to clean your mats. Mm -hmm. So I know you all love a good comparison video. Tanner's Get coming at you with that. that. And then look guys, this is another, you know, little thing. Notice how far apart these are. And again, the line space is just go bring it together. This is so much easier than making them a separate text box mm -hmm. and lining them up and everything like that. And one thing you'll notice is my little eye. What we need to do is click a line and just a line center. Oh, I clicked a line left on accident. A line center and that Ooh. will fix it right up. Perfect. Right? Who knew? Why wouldn't they be aligned when you do that? Who knows? You know, At least we okay. know how to it's, align. It's, you know, in that for the um, awesome, you know, formatting. So we can just unlock that and we can make this a little bit wider if we want. Make it a little bit smaller. And kind of play around with it to our liking. And you can kind of see how it's doing right here. And then you can just bring it down to your other one that we're designing here. And then you're almost done. We're going to weld this sucker together and we're going to be home. We're going to have a home, home run with our little project as I drag that away. So then you can select all three of these, and just play around with it, do anything that you may need to, um, you know, with it, make some room or anything, just like that. And once you're happy with it, you're gonna wanna go ahead and select all three layers and you're going to click weld. And you can also attach this. This is a total um, great way that you can um, weld or attach. And the font we're working with for this project is Add a Girl. And then the font for the second one um, that we designed first is Click Clack. Both can be found on the website today. 
So once you've selected all three layers, um, you're going to want to come right here and be able to select all three. They'll light up on the right hand sidebar and you'll want to click weld just like that. So we can delete these out because we already have them designed up here at the top. So if we scroll up, you can see right here. Now what we're going to need to do is go ahead and weld this or we have it attached, so that's fine. And then this one is gonna be good as well. Rachel, if I can have the overhead camera, what I wanna talk about next is measuring your shirts to see how much sizing you have. So here's one t-shirt we got. This is a medium. So this one right here is gonna be the toilet paper roll. Um, so we want to always do three inches down from the top minimum and then you can see we have probably about eight inches wide for today's shirt. You could probably go all the way to nine. I think nine would be okay. Yeah, maybe eight and a half. And then for our large, what we've got is for this one right here, we are going to do 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 do. Let's see what nine looks like. So nine looks perfect for this one, but could go up to 10, but maybe nine and a half. So we'll do eight and a half and nine and a half for these two shirts. I think it depends also because the toilet paper roll is so much longer than it is right. wide. So you want to take that into account too. I mean, you don't want it to go like all the way down your entire for shirt. Sure. So think about that when you guys yeah. are sizing these at home. So again, and we're also go practice making sure we go at least three inches down from the same minimum. Um, you can do more or less depending on what you need. Um, so yay! Now Rachel has pulled up an amazing sheet for you guys to take a look at. Um, this is an awesome one that you get off the Makers and Learn dashboard. You guys can download this heat placement and vinyl sizing chart. So for an adult, um, small to large, nine to nine and a half is perfect. And it placed top of the design three to three and a half inches below neckline. It's like we, we have everything ready for you. And you can find this chart and download it today right under the decal sizing printable guide under your dashboard for the Makers Learn website. So all you wanna do is after you're signed in, you can click dashboard um, from the top right. So we love, love, love our member resources. And Tanner, we have a question over on Facebook. Miss Tara says, hey, Tara. I have a Cricut Explore Air 2. Can I do this with my machine or do I have to have a maker? Miss Tara, you are more than happy to do it with your Cricut Explore Air 2. Um, we are so excited that you can do that with your fine point blade. Um, so yay, super excited for you to be able to make this project. But here we guys go. We're gonna size this to nine and a half wad. And then the 2020 Survivor can be sized at eight and a half. And for this one, we may end up doing it a little bit smaller because it's gonna be nine inches um, long. So we're at 10, so we'll do right at seven and a half wad. Let's see, okay, we'll do eight. So this right here, perfect. Um, Team HLK says, oh, the chart is awesome. I'm a new member for about a week and haven't been able to explore, explore everything. So this is good to know. Yes, be sure guys, as soon as you become members, explore around, take full advantage. We're so excited. Rachel has dropped the links as well to get your Summit Passport today for 30 off using the coupon code FLASH30 um, for Summer Summit, your year membership or your passport. If you guys love these free trainings, you are, get treated at the summit so we'd love to have you guys there so we're gonna press make it and then what we're gonna do is mirror these images and what we're going to do first is the white mat is gonna be on our first and then the or excuse me the 2020 survivors could be black and the second mat will be white you can change those in Cricut if you need to or just make mental notes I would change it in Cricut if you had more than like Three, more than yeah. two mats, if you had more than that, it might get a for little confusing. Sure. But for two, you guys got this. Yeah. You know? So we're going to go ahead and click Everyday Iron On, and we're using it from the scrap bin. So we have two different kinds, guys. The watt today is Cricut Iron On, and I hope it goes well. So this is, if you guys know, the Cricut kind of changed their formula, and it just is a little hard to get down. It's not hard to cut, it's not hard to weed or anything. But when you're using iron-on, notice that I mirrored my image. Very important. 
because this is a dull side of that product and here's a super shiny side so you guys can see this right here um, very different and then what you're going to do is line this up and I need to put the black down first I was cutting I'm cutting the first mat I said that already and then you can put this down right here just like so put this down and I think this is just regular Caesar easy wheat so this will it be is. great uh -huh. yeah so now we can just load this in I have the pink maker today we've been changing it up very intentionally on you guys showing you some explore stuff showing you some different things uh what'd you say Rachel oh I like this oh <laughs> if you guys can see Rachel right now she has uh six machines on her desk right now which is I do. so funny I do. I'm surrounded um, by just crafting yeah. right will you turn fast mode on for me sure thank you and then we'll press that flashing cricket button. But guys, let us know what questions you have. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the easy press on to 315 for 30 seconds. We're gonna get a drink of water. And there already is a question. Miss mm. Tasha says, could this be done on the joy? So Miss Tasha, you would have to design your shirt four and a half inches wide. Um, our shirt today is eight and a half and nine and a half inches wide. So if you do um, smaller sizes, yes, you can totally do that. Maybe great for a onesie. Oh my gosh, it would be adorable for the onesie. A social distancing onesie. Don't touch me, I'm a baby. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would not Maybe want. You need that shirt. <laughs> Maybe I need that shirt. <laughs> Becca's. Oh 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 no. Okay, we're we're good. We're Can good. No, no, fast mode's great. We're using a scrap piece, so I wasn't sure if it was going to cut off my design. Um, but yay! So we've got our Easy Press mat. The Easy Press mat is the foolproof, like, perfect result for today's project. You really need a, a an Easy Press mat. And especially, if, guys, if you're working with heat transfer vinyl without an Easy Press or a heat press, um, the Easy Press mat can actually do you a solid when using your household iron. Um, so we're, we love it. Oh my, make sure you have a blade in your machine. Were you watching that live stream where I didn't have a blade in my machine? That was the most embarrassing thing I think I have ever, I was just so embarrassed. I wish Rachel was here that night. Um, it probably wouldn't have happened if she was here. Oh, I but, had my um, own great embarrassment about, what was that, two days ago? Did yeah. you? Yeah, so I think it's Becca's turn. We'll see what Ooh, happens. Ooh, we'll see what happens to Becca. <laughs> We're not wishing it. We're, we just no, are expecting no, it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I was born to social distance. <laughs> me too. You guys cracked me up. Me too. Oh, okay, so I'm going to weed this without using the mat because it, it can be done. It's just not fun. And then I'm gonna put the watt down. I'm really scared to use this watt today, guys. I'm not even joking with you, because you all have witnessed me fail epically with this before. And once a product does me wrong, I get worried. But it's in the scrap bin, so we're using it. Because you guys get mad when we don't use scrap. I, I say that it's a scrap, but it's a really big scrap. It's a big scrap. Yeah. Make sure mirror's on, it is. And then we're going to grab our pin pin tool. And, and look, cleaner. guys, I can save some more. Can someone do this if they don't have an easy press? Yes, use that household iron. I was just talking about um, getting this easy press mat. We love this easy press mat because it's going to send heat back up into your project and help it even it out. Um, you can do it, but uh, it's really a great product. If you do not have one of these and you don't want to get one, you are more than welcome to use a terry cloth, terry cloth towel folded four times um, to protect you and help your project. So look, I'm weeding without a mat. It's so hard, honestly, like for real. But yes, let us know if we have any first time viewers. We'd love to welcome you to our crafty hangout with our community. Um, let us know if you have any qu craft questions for anyone that may have, you know, basic t-shirt questions. Great live stream to answer um, some Q&A today. And Miss Tara over on Facebook asked another amazing question. Hey Tara, I, I love these questions. I do love, love answering this one with analogies. Ooh. She asks, how often do I need to change my Cricut blade? And my it's just answer, like that oil change. How often do you need to change the oil in your car, Tara? It's the same thing. We have to change our blades 
I would I would say once a month. Probably. But let me tell you, we're we like craft. a truck driver. We're always constantly yes. on the move with our cricket. Maintenance constantly. There's always something to be done to better our crickets and things like that. But if you do not craft, let's say you craft twice a week, then you, you can probably last able, a few months. Yeah, and it also depends on the materials you use. Mm -hmm. If you're doing glitter, glitter paper stock every single yep. day, mm -hmm. or glitter paper, great example, Tanner. Same thing. Um, or if you're just cutting really light 60 pound cardstock every day, it yeah. can last even longer. And yeah. I think, I don't know if this is true, so again, ask Troy at 651 Vinyl, he would know. Um, I think cutting heat transfer vinyl and just vinyl in general is probably easier on the blade than paper and craft board and stuff like that. Probably. So you can just you know test it all we like to always have some replacements because you never know when we're going to go into a quarantine um courtney had to rush to hobby lobby today because she was like tanner i've got to go to hobby lobby because i don't know if we're gonna have a stay-at-home order i mean a few counties here in tennessee already do have a stay-at-home order and i think at that point is when they would shut down our essential stores like hobby lobby um but i very much consider hobby lobby essential so um, she went and socked up. So anyway, look at this. Rachel, I was able to weed without a mat. I know, but it wasn't fun. I'm it was sure. not. It was not and fun. And Tanner, uh, we have, let me see here, Miss Yolanda and Ronnie, our first hey, time Hey, welcome, here. welcome, welcome. So excited to have you guys. And then, let's see. Uh, Seth says, last time I did a shirt, the vinyl started coming off after a few washes. Ooh. What did I do wrong? Okay, Seth, let's go over the checklist yeah, for making yeah. the best t-shirt. First of all, you have to pre-wash the shirt before you apply the heat transfer vinyl without using fabric softener. Step one. Step two, are you washing your shirts inside out? You need to wash your shirts inside out. Um, step three, make sure to dry them on, you know, a, kind of a delicate cycle. Um, so it's a lot, a lot of fun. Sheila, hello. So glad to see you, my friend. Um, but yeah, those are the three main things that you want to do. Make sure to heat the back of your shirt and everything like that. So great, great questions, guys. Great questions. So yeah, we've got this one right here. While that is still cutting, we can go ahead and hit this shirt. We're gonna get our green, and we're already preheated at 315 for 30 seconds. And Tanner, Miss Lori said, just received my pin pin tool. What a difference. Oh my gosh, guys, it's a whole different process, but you're going to absolutely love it. Like, just give it a chance and you'll fall in love with it. I think it was a hard sell for me and Rachel, but once we figure out how to use it and where to use it the most, we love it. So I preheated the shirt, very important. And then here's how to align it perfectly, guys. You wanna take this seam of your shirt and take this seam of your shirt, fold it, fan it out. So I lift it up. You're gonna create this line. So I already preheated it. I'm gonna preheat it again, create this line so you know the exact center of your shirt. Okay. And Tanner, Miss Ashley said, hi, just joined the Cricut World and joined Makers Gonna Learn. Hi. Thank you so much for all the help. Welcome, welcome, Miss Ashley. So you've got this line right here. Now you've got to figure out where the line is for the center of your cut file. So you want to fold it right here, find the two further, furthest points, just like so. So right about here. And you want to pinch, just right at the top. So you've lined up the two furthest points, pinched at the top, and then you want to line up your two lines right here. And then I like to lay it down to kind of see how it does. And then I like to double check my work to make sure we're three inches or so from the neckline. And look at this, we pretty much are. So that is awesome. And Tanner, what temperature is our Easy Press today? Today it's at 315. Um, depending on your fabric depends on exactly what you need. And the best resource to look at is your Cricut printable guide. Um, if you are a Makers Gonna Learn member, you can download that today. It's over 30 pages and it is so, so good for all of your Cricut needs. Okay, so um, we are now gonna be able to lift up this and we are gonna hit this for 30 seconds. Move it up a bit. I see some, do, 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 do. no, no, like that easy press. Oh, okay, thank there you. There you go. We'll do it in two different, two different spots. So yay. How are you guys doing on this Friday? Let us know. I see lots of people out and about. There was a group of eight ladies, guys. It was <laughs> early this around. morning too. They were I was like, you all are not social distancing. 
They're probably in one family or something like that. Rachel, it was my cousin. I kid you not. Tanner, I think that number one, it was everyone my cousins. is your cousin. I think number two, no. you know everyone in Morristown. You think they're all your cousins. No, Rachel, I promise you, I can tell you the names Tanner, you of say, the cousins. You point to people and you're like, that's my cousin. I, I'm like, what? Lisa How, who and is giving birth to all of these cousins of yours? Wait. You know, Rachel, I know you've never met my dad because I haven't met my dad, but I do know a lot yeah. of the cousins that are on my dad's I side of the family. I knew that was going there. Okay. I knew it. Okay. I just feel like I'm just got, saying. I feel like you've got a lot of family here. They're you all are... here. Here are Sneedville. <laughs> Guys, I'm just saying that was my cousin. She lives right down the road from me. Wait, what's her name? Who is Haley it? Noe. Haley she just Noe. got married. Oh, yeah. Yeah, her and That's her mom the same no as the and the whole family was walking. I'm pretty Emily sure Noe that was and them. Hannah Noe. That's yes. not the same. Yes. You're related to them? Yes. I love them. They used to work out with me at the gym. I don't know what I happened. Love that. She almost she moved away, but anyway. I love it. I love it. You guys are my favorite. <laughs> okay. So as you can see, look at these bubbles. Look at these bubbles. So good. And then now the bubbles show that it's done, so you can just peel it up. Okay. So we've got this. That's cute. Look at this. Okay, I was doubting Becca, honestly, I was just with the black heat transfer vinyl yep. on this green, but it looks so good. It does. I love it. And Tanner, we got a good question. Ooh, a good question. If I buy a Summit Passport and already attended the spring, what will the discount be? So scroll down to the bottom of the Summit Passport page and click on the get just the summer and just the fall. That will be perfect for you and use the flash 30 coupon code um, and you're gonna be so, so good. Um, oh, you just saw the Insta story about the new craft house. Yay, love it. Guys, head um, over craft to Instagram. House. I know, craft, craft house. house, craft house. That's hilarious. I love it. Um, okay, so I'm gonna fold this one up. This shirt turned out to be beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And no, guys, Tanner, I, Tanner wasn't joking. He's actually never met his dad, but <laughs> they think you're guys, kidding. No, I'm he's not. not kidding. I'm not. It's totally fun. Yeah, he's with Tanner's great. <laughs> he turned out great. It's so funny. Um, I tried to one time, but that will be a story for another day. We can't. We can't, we give, can't give all away. the stories away. No. Go ask one of Tanner's cousins. All of more. Oh my gosh, <laughs> Rachel. It cracks me up. I have like two. Rachel. Joseph. Ch Ch Rachel, that is not true. I got a couple in Georgia. All your, yeah, I was about to say, all your cousins are in Georgia. They are. I wish they were closer. You go visit them a few times a year, and I'm like, wait, what? Terrible thinks I'm lying, just going no. somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> she just needs an extra day off, guys. Yeah, yeah. I love it. I love it. Okay, now again, I said this material was not that great. And yes, guys, um, Somewhere very close to us, Knoxville is on home lockdown. <gasps> it are, is. Right? Yeah. Yeah, mandatory. And they are literally. They're shutting off. Courtney told me this. They're shutting off power and water on establishments that are not following the rules. Oh, that was in Los Angeles County. Oh, of I've, I've read in Knoxville. No, I've read Courtney so many headlines. Oh, well, that's confused. okay. She's probably got them all jumbled in. Yeah. That scared the crap out of me. I'm like, are you kidding? They're locked. No more water power for you guys. Come no, on. Knox County also came out and said that they're hoping just people, like, do the right thing. Like, they put out the order. They're obviously, you know, Knox County is really large. Right. Um, so they can't oh, monitor everything. Yeah. So they're just asking everyone to, you know, use good judgment and obviously close. But then they interviewed a few establishments that would not close. And I thought that was kind of funny. But, um, yeah, the car wash has not yet to close. But anywho. Miss Nicole is here. She said, new subscriber here. I Hi, just Ms. got Nicole. my cricket yesterday. Ooh, welcome so to the I'm Crafty learning. Fun. We're you so excited right to have place, you. Nicole. Yes, we are the place to be for everything you need with your cricket needs. So let us know how we can serve you better with any questions you may have. This is a great time to have some live friend support. Sis um, said, said, you're going to have to do lives on Zoom. Oh my gosh, we could just do a whole Crafty Hangout where you all could just put your cameras on. Fun fact, my gym, since all gyms are closed for the next few weeks, um, we have been doing uh, group workouts, but I would have joined today, but again, like Rachel, uh, like I told Rachel, Becca had to teach me how to use my espresso maker and my trainers weren't doing the training this morning. So, you know, you have to, we have two locations. The other gym was doing it. 
but I need to try one of the Zoom workout times. And Miss Michelle said, Tanner, do you have a big box of scraps like we do? Michelle, ours yes. is a tub. Yeah. It's like a, it's yeah. something. It's great. It's something. Look at this pen pen tool. This right here is the perfect time to have a pen pen tool. They're so sharp. They get in all the little inserts of your letters. And it's honestly perfection. Like honest perfection. And Team HLK, I'm not from Georgia. I'm from here, born and raised. I just have some family from Georgia that was born here. How did here they that end moved. up? Okay. So yeah, they it's my dad's sister. They all um, went over there. Is it Aunt Cindy? It's Aunt Cindy, yes. I think I met her at your wedding, so I guess I believe she's real. You did. She's real. She's real. <laughs> People say I look like her and my Aunt Kathy. Uh -huh. Both my your aunts. Your poor mom. I'm kidding. You look just like your mom, too. I would, if I looked half as beautiful as mom, wow. I would be fine. She's wow. Gorgeous. Where is Becky at to get this compliment? When is Becky coming on the show? Can you follow so up with her on that? She wants to I'm come ready. anytime. She says, I just don't want to get in Tanner's way or your way. Oh, my way. gosh. We I don't need wanna, her on I the said, show. I said, Mom, we need to make you a shirt or something. Right. We just have to, you just yes. tell me the day and we'll make room. She, know, guys, her. she asks about you all, all the time. She gets <laughs> her heart just... It's Has so, she talked to you about, about like, guys. after, you know, everything happened? Like, because I know me and you have talked about it. But, like, what does she think, like, now that, like, she was able to see so much support? Do you really of, like, want to know, Tana? Sure. I don't know. She thinks that I'm famous. Oh, I'm yes. <laughs> she, she tells everyone that I'm famous, but I just don't tell anybody. And I'm like, Mom, I'm famous. <laughs> I forgot famous that was the thing. With, I wouldn't call it famous either. You just I'm, have a lot of friends, right? I'm, I'm very blessed and loved by a very <laughs> niche group of amazing crafters. Oh, my gosh. That, we, once you said that, that reminded me of the day I went over to see your mom. She kept raving about She just couldn't believe it. No, God. She couldn't believe it. it. I remember It that. blew her away. She it was, was so funny. astonished by your all's amazing generosity and that you don't, you know, hadn't even physically met me and didn't know her. And I said, Mom, I've got the so best funny. group of amazing supporters. You just don't know. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at how fast I'm weeding this. Like, for such a detailed design. Um, and Tanner, what what are you using to weed someone? So this right know? here is our pin pin tool. They're from 651 Vinyl, which unfortunately had to close at 830 last night due to everything happening here. Um, but you can still order this and it'll ship out as soon as they open back up. Sherry this told a, me that yesterday. This is a pin so pin sad. tool. Um, here's the sharp little pin please don't write with it i will not nathan no nathan picked it up the other day and i said Bless nathan you can't he's the smartest <laughs> kid literally but Cute. sometimes so right here we've got our design i was socially distancing before it was cool and this font is the click clack click clack just downloaded today uh, melissa says i'm sad i had placed my first order for vinyl in a pin pin tool but i won't get it until it opens back up miss melissa please just be patient they are so excited absence um, makes the heart grow fonder just, yes just wait we are get so it. excited for them um to open back up very soon let me tell you it had to be um we have been able to see the 651 operation and i know their whole team has to be devastated they work so hard um troy has has such a great operation there um so i know they're just as devastated as you are and i promise once they get back up and going you're gonna have like the best customer experience ever their typical shipping times is so um awesome like i trust me melissa you're gonna love it um but yeah so we're gonna preheat this shirt and do we have any questions i think i saw a question and we missed it Oh. Carol says, maybe share about what happened to your folks for those who don't know. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, on November 13th, this oh, gosh, past you remember year, the date. Yeah, oh, of course I do. It was the worst day of my life. <laughs> on November 13th this past year, uh, my mom was recovering in the hospital from a surgery she had to have. And we got a call that uh, my parents' house was on fire, my childhood home that I lived for 20 years. And... Um, we weren't concerned because thankfully nobody was in there. We were only concerned for our, our babies, our puppies. And uh, we were in Knoxville, so that was terrible. My dad was called, of course, he got there first. Uh, we lost our pups and the majority of the home uh, was burned. And then between the fire guys, the fire damage and the water from the oh, amazing yeah, the water damage. fire fire, it was just, it was bad. So. And of course, we like to say we wouldn't care if that place burnt to the ground if we had gotten our dogs out. That's right. that was the worst thing ever, knowing how they how they went. But God is so good, and no one was there, and we just have to remind ourselves daily that the Lord took the least that He could, and we are thankful for that. And my parents were able to rebuild, and it's and almost she's done. Yeah, they've went through yes. the whole redesign process. They're and, staying at a little 
um, apartment that apartment? Tanner found, guys. Yeah, they were going to have so to stay. Good. Not saying it's bad to stay there, but they were going to have to stay for like five months in a little uh, five months hotel. Is a long time. Yeah, in a hotel. So uh, it was really bad. My mom was in the hospital. They had to sedate her when she found out her babies didn't make it. Um, How sad. But you know, God is good, and they're going to be in there soon, and we, we will miss those babies every day, but we're just one day at a time. Yep. But yeah, so, okay, yeah. guys, I promised you this heat transfer vinyl is going to give me a treble, and I'm going to let it cool. I'm going to hit the back. Oh, yeah, yeah, Tara, that was the trick yeah. to let this stuff cool all the way, I think. Yeah, yeah. So I see, I see some dots. This needs to be hit again, I think. This looks good. This looks good. We're going to let it cool for a, minute, a bit. Um, but yeah, so it is Friday. Let us know what you guys have mm -hmm. got going on for everything. And Tanner, I don't know if you've decided yet, but when are you going to stop the sale? We have some people oh, wondering. Oh, tonight is the last um, time. We had some people wondering this morning, so we extended it oh. um, for you guys. But today is the official last uh, day of it. It's a flash sale, so these usually go real quick. Um, so if you guys are on the fence, definitely take the plunge and join us for um, our year membership if you need um, a passport. Another great thing to take advantage of for our summits. If you guys saw all the fun projects everyone are making in the Facebook group, definitely take advantage of it. We would love to have you guys at a virtual summit. Um, it is so, so fun. Oh, every live makes me want to adopt Tanner more and more. <laughs> adopt Tanner. <laughs> oh my gosh. I heard yesterday you all realized that me and Becca were brother and sister, yep. um, which yep. is so true. Um, so you guys crack me up, but, um, I love that. And Tanner, Miss. I met my dad though. Oh, um, Becca said so we're good. Half, we're Becca half. said she's made her, she's met her dad though. I love it. Mary Ann wants to know, is this HTV from Cricket? Yes, Miss Mary Ann, I miss you. I hope you're staying safe, dear. Um, but, uh, yes, it is. We have a trouble using it. We're going to let this cool extra, um, before peeling it up. If you notice before we were able to peel rot up, this right here, um, you know, takes a little bit longer. So notice, I, I want to show you guys. I want to show you on an area. So like this right here is totally down perfect. Um, well, it's really not. Like it just sticks a lot more. This right here for sure has to get hit again. So I'm going to apply a lot of pressure and then we're going to let it cool quite a bit. So And yay. Miss Lady TX, uh, I, we would love to answer your question. Just copy and paste that in the yeah, we uh, missed comments it. below. We're so sorry we missed it. Yeah, and if you guys are just tuning in, um, the fonts used, this was Click Clack, and then the other one is called Add a Girl, and mm -hmm. we used the Ballin um, toilet paper roll. So, so good. So, so good. I'm not a fan of it either. It was just in our scrap bin, and I told Rachel we need to use more scraps, so this is what she's blessed me with, was this this scrap right oh, okay. here. Okay, I wish you could have seen the side eye he just gave me, because I, I felt it. I think I felt it. Um, yeah. Um, I love it. Wait, it people are actually thinking we're, we're brother and sister now. It's because you said it's so, so true. I know. Because you weren't paying I know. attention. I know. It's not. Uh, they're not we're related. Not. We're they not. might be. They might be cousins, I'm sure. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it could be cousins. It could be cousins. Your, your father's from where? Uh, he's from Hancock County. Yeah. Yeah, so is my mom. I and think they were from Sneedville. That's where, that's Hancock County. Yeah, Hancock County. Sneedville. Yeah. yeah. That's what Isn't County that is. Isn't that horrible? I mean, my... <laughs> Isn't that horrible? Becca, yeah, we need to go. I mean, I mean, horrible that I didn't know that. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. 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 I, I got to be in geography. Don't ask me. Uh, Miss Tasha. Myers are from Thornhill. The, yeah, that's from... Thornhill area. We could be related. <gasps> okay. Yeah, Carol, it was Raheem and Rowan. There we go. Uh, this is... Letting it this. cools the secret. But the other one is Caesar Easy Weed. That's what we love. Yeah, letting yeah. it cools the secret. Caesar Easy Weed does not need it as much. And Gigi, Tanner, do we know when the Makers Gonna Learn logos are gonna be available for them? I think uh, we'll Patty said soon. it was in a soon collection. Yeah, soon. we wanna add it so that we then spend some time making Makers Gonna Learn merch for like a week. Oh yeah. Um, because we wanna make some craft projects and then we wanna do some shirts and bags mm -hmm. and things. So just get ready for that. We're probably gonna do it sometime in April. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Um, let us know when you guys want it. And I'm this, ready. The more you ask for it, the sooner we'll probably get it to you. We need to make some print the cut merch and all Ooh, kinds of stuff I to show it. you guys everything. But yeah, guys, check this out. 2020 Survivor. 
I was social distancing before it was cool. Both of these are so much fun. We loved both of these. And guys, you can make both of these with the amazing, amazing year membership. So I love it. Is the toilet paper shirt one of the Make It Now options? Miss Sherry, this is designed for Maker's Gonna Learn fonts and cut falls. So this right here, the toilet paper roll, is a Maker's Gonna Learn cut fall. And then this font right here is an amazing um, font called Add a Girl from the Maker's Learn font. So you have to be a year member to build this project out. If you just tuned in, feel free to rewind the video, watch after this is posted, and you'll be able to see how to construct this. We give all the tips and tricks for formatting, everything like that for both of these projects. So you're going to be able to master both two awesome shirts, um, maybe for your kids, maybe your spouse, yourself, anyone like that, friends, um, you know, and have a lot of fun. So yay! Melody made some badge reels and keychains. Yay! I love it. Those so are so good. cute. I love it. But yeah, so guys, that is your shirts. I hope you guys loved both of these. They're amazing. We loved making these. Um, I'm totally going to change out of the shirt and put this one on now. Um, I love these shirts. They're so good. And they're really adorable. So I love it. <laughs> Baby, I'm a lifetime member. Woohoo! <laughs> I love that. And Tanner, this is a good question. Um, Miss Lady TX said, I have a maker and the joy. Yay. Would getting an Explore Air 2 do things the maker can't? Nope. Nope. It will not. So at anything, the maker is the top of the line Cricut machine um, on the market right now. And if you have this, this is it's as good as it gets right now for us. Um, and the Cricut Explorer 2 has the fine point blade. So anything we cut with the fine point blade can be cut in the Explorer 2. And then the Joy is like its own ecosystem. So <laughs> it's a lot of fun. But yay, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's live stream. Let us know if you have any questions. Rachel, if you want to share the screen one last time, I'll give answers to some of the Summit Passport questions and just different things we've seen around the block of course. Um, for you guys. So real quick, this is the year membership. If you guys need to get a year membership, definitely take advantage of our best value today for year members only. You can become a year member um, and save so much money and get so much more. So we give you guys the best of both worlds with this. Just click get the deal and use the coupon code FLASH30. That ends today. Um, and then for the Summer Summit, you can go down here to the Summer Summit link and grab your ticket for one summit or if you guys want to get on the supply kit train which is so popular you guys can go ahead and notice it'll say book your ticket and this is for all three you don't do not need that so scroll down to the bottom and it says already have your spring ticket book my other two tickets and this right here until the 31st of this month which is you know the 27th right now um, you can get in on the supply kits for both the summer summit and fall summit which is over a $50 value in the supply kit where we send you supplies we'll use at the summit so if you guys want that click on that summit passport scroll down to the bottom and press the book my other two tickets and then use the flash 30 coupon code flash 30 and press upon woohoo so then you got your discount and you can book your other two summits. So we're so, so excited for that. Um, and it's a lot, a lot of fun. So yay, um, right like that. So we are so excited for you guys and it is gonna be awesome. Um, but yes, let us know if you have any questions and it is so good. Um, but thank you all. I did see a question. Um, if you get emails about joining and you're not a member, chances are you opted in for one of our freebies um, that are usually prompted more for people that aren't members. So you can um, email us and we'll get you off of that list and make sure you're on your member list because we send just as many awesome emails to our members, making sure you guys are downloading cut files, seeing the projects, seeing the videos, and not asking you um, if you need to become a member. So let us know. Um, just reply to those emails, hi at makersgonnalearn.com and customer service will fix you right up. So You don't want to miss out on the awesome member email. Yeah, if you're a member and you're not getting member-related yeah. emails, you need those member-related emails because it's a lot of fun. Yeah. We spend a lot of time on both email lists uh, making sure we get you guys what you need. Um, so woohoo! Thank you, Miss Dawn. You guys, you are awesome. Great live as usual. Keep healthy and stay safe. Yes, you too as well. Age, or, our friend, will the summit be virtually done? Yes, all of our summits for 
well over the past two years have been all virtual crafting events. They are amazing and we love it. So um, they are two days, a Saturday and a Sunday. The ones upcoming is July 25th and 26th, and then October 3rd and 4th. Um, they are 10 classes, 10 one hour classes roughly, and you get those for lifetime access. So if you say yes to the Summit Passport before the end of this month, you can get in not only and save $30 today using the code FLASH30, but we'll also send you a supply kit for both summits. And as you guys know, we don't send out many things at all. No. And we have amazing vendors we partner with, like Benzy Felt we partnered with for the Spring Summit. Sculpey Clay. And Sculpey Clay. So many awesome people. So many more that we're gonna be partnering with. We've had a 651 vinyl, um, you know, sponsor before. So it's a lot, a lot of fun. But thank you guys so much. Megan got their, her passport yesterday. Woohoo! Thanks for brightening my day. Perks of working from home. I love that, Anita. But guys, thank you so much. I hope you all have a fantastic Friday and enjoy your weekend. And we'll see you back here real soon. Bye, friends.